Open Store is a platform to handle your Kindle highlights. It's one place to annotate, tag, export, and view insights on all that you read. Basically, it's perfect for the avid Kindle reader who wants to organize their library and have more control over how to review and access their books. We're gonna start by logging in with Google. I already done that just to speed up the process. Once you do that, you're gonna be taken to this page and greeted with an upload model. You're gonna click the upload model. As you can see here, you have to go to Kindle, then documents, and then access your myclipping.txt, which will be located at the bottom. Once you click that, it's gonna automatically parse them, upload them, organize them into genres, and then import them for you. This is what your library should look like, obviously with different books. One of the features that I like is at a glance. At a glance, gives you the book at a glance. It gives you the breakdown of it, Greg McCowan, when you started reading it, the amount of pages and number of highlights you made. Also annotated tag, so you can like either say, yeah, I've annotated the book. If you've gone through it, made all your highlights. It gives you the genre that it automatically categorizes it into. Also, it gives you this highlights over time. This graph is very, very useful. It basically shows you the activity of your reading throughout the time of starting and finishing the book. Below that, we have the description of the book. And maybe we read this, we're like, oh yeah, this book was great. Let me jump to the book. Let me actually go in and see my highlights. That will take you to the highlight page. This is where all your highlights are. Everything you've highlighted in your Kindle will be here. So we can tag them as favorited. We can also come here and go more in depth and then add tags to the book. For example, we could say this book is very good or very nice. <laughs> Below that, you can add a note to go more in depth. You can add multiple, it's gonna date tag them in case you wanna come back to the book and then re-add tags. You're gonna see, oh, this is my thought on February the 26th, 2025. This is how I was thinking. And then you're gonna come back and then add a new note, add a new note. You can go through, I wanted it to be quick so you can filter by or sort by ascending, descending, sort by page. Also filter by the tags that you just created. Jumping off of that theme of quick navigation, we created a modal, a search modal, which allows you to quickly navigate and maneuver through the site. So you can access that modal by clicking control K, or you could just simply just click the search. And then you can just search in whatever book you want. So like David Goggins, for example, click enter. It will take you to that page straight away. You can even jump to specific highlights and it will automatically pick it up and show you which highlight was searched for. Okay, let's go back to the library page. There's a couple of shortcuts that you should know. First of all was a control K, which we just shown. Control B will open the sidebar. And this is where you can upload your clippings and also see new features that are coming. Currently, we're developing the analytics page. This is going to show you graphs and analytics of all your reading history, giving you more of a deeper insight of what you read, your favorite reading time, your favorite author, your favorite types of books, your favorite types of quotes. If you have any questions, open the sidebar and then leave some feedback and support and then we'll get to it straight away. Thank you so much for watching this video. I really appreciate you. If you have any questions, Shout me, storeclippings at gmail.com. I'm going to answer them all. I'm going to implement them all as quick as possible. And yeah, thank you.